Content, boys. <laughs> Content time. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so we had this whole plan of how we were going to make this video, but then we realized we're actually incapable of forming a couple basic sentences together to make it into a proper script. <laughs> <laughs> so we even had this flowchart going on and still couldn't figure out how to present this nicely in a video. Anyway, so we made this new website, we call it the Launchpad Farmer Utility. Well, actually, Brendan came up with most of it, but anyway, it, it lets all of you like easily update the firmware on your launchpads with the push of a button. Quick disclaimer, if it doesn't work, actually try turning it off and on again. I I'm serious, MIDI is actually a very trashy standard. It sucks. Alongside getting your launchpads up to date with official firmware, you also get to install the latest cutting edge build of my custom firmware within seconds. For those of you still using Ableton for your light effects, <laughs> We spent like a week? Well, I spent more like oh, a couple of weeks. Okay, yeah, shut up, Brendan. <laughs> no, this just sounds so fucking forced. <laughs> uh, yeah, I spent a week or so making the palette utility, which lets you directly modify the palette inside your Launchpad's firmware. That means you won't need to run Retina constantly to translate the color palette anymore, but rather your Launchpad will permanently display exactly the color palette that you want. It kind of messes with the setup UI on some Launchpads, but d don't worry about that, that's intended. Uh, for the custom firmware, you can directly modify the three custom palettes stored on the launchpad. To download a palette from the launchpad, you can press the up key in the onboard editor. And that basically sums up today's trashy upload. Uh, just don't forget to install the drivers because Windows MIDI sucks and yeah, bye. I, I was expecting more Brandon in this video, dude. <laughs> I, I, didn't see I didn't know when to, when to hop in. I didn't want to disturb the flow, man. Ah!